I'm about to dive straight into Digicam. Here's what makes it awesome and what to watch out for. You're looking at Digicam, a powerhouse open source photo manager for Windows, Mac, and Linux. I'll show you why it's a top pick for organizing huge collections, tagging faces, editing raw shots, and why it might feel a bit rough around the edges. First, Digicam places all your photos where they already live without copying them, which means no extra clutter and your library stays lean. It builds smart databases side by side so you can tag faces, plot shots on an interactive map, and even auto tag images with its built-in AI. Now let's talk features. It supports over 200 raw formats, full 16-bit color depth, batch editing, red-eye removal, geolocation search, and seamless export to Flickr, Facebook, Google Earth, you name it. The latest update, version 8.6, released March 15, 2025, polished AI tagging, face management, image quality tools, and red-eye fixes. On the flip side, it can be slow on huge libraries, and as some users note, clicks can feel clunky or crash-prone under heavy load. The worst case, your actual photos stay safe. And be cautious with delete. Digicam will remove the actual file unless you undo it via its trash. Here's the TLDR. If you've got a big photo stash, need raw editing, AI tagging, mapping, or face recognition, all for free, Digicam is a brilliant choice. Just give it a bit of patience and remember backups before mass deleting. Verdict. For photographers, travelers, or digital pack rats who want full control, raw power, and no vendor lock-in, Digicam is your new best friend. Just pack some time and save often.